ongoing um, interest of mine, which is to do with um, radio and transmission. Um, the first piece I'm going to do is actually a, a radio broadcast. Um, so it's a pre-recorded piece. Um, I just need to set it up, actually. So. Basically, it's a pre-recorded piece which plays with the conventions of... Um, um, of welcoming to the show. Oh dear. If you've got the arches, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's not what I wanted to play. Um, yeah, it plays with the conventions of um, the introduction to a show, to a radio show. And I'll say a bit more about it at the end. Um, it's about four minutes long. Sound of coming up next. <laughs> 
Um, so that, there's a few references in that that I wanted to kind of go through. Um, one is Orson Welles' War of the Worlds, which was a kind of important radio um, transmission. Um, I should say, actually, uh, right now, um, this was a kind of collaborative process. I was working with Holly on this quite a lot. And um, we both got interested in radio a while ago. And we've, we've done a lot of this work together um, and in collaboration. So um, I was interested in radios linked to ruination and, and apocalypse, the idea of the emergency broadcast. Um, Radio Caroline and the pirate radios of the 60s, which were legally in extraterritorial waters. Um, and that links to an early 20th century idea of the, the ether through which radio was supposedly transmitted as an ocean. People talk about the, the etheric ocean, so this is a maritime metaphor. Um, and then the idea of atmospherics and the politics that might come with and of, of the politics of at atmosphere, if you like, um, which form a sort of public space. And actually, this was an idea that I um, took on with um, the composer and um, singer that I collaborated with last year when we um, were talking about the idea of music as a space, as a kind of local weather, um, which would, could affect people within its range. Um, so I'm going to read a poem now. Um, actually, Holly's going to help me with this one, because um, another of the things I'm interested in is um, multiple voices and using creating poems which can be which need to be read by more than one person really so another way of taking it away from just the person in their own writing um, this is called building stone form it comes from it's like a sample if you like from um, a text called a uh, tour of the monuments of Passaic by um, Robert Smithson who's a US uh, land artist um, and do you want to help me um, from, so I've only got one yeah let's stand up we've only got one thing so. <laughs> um, <yeah. clears throat> Buildings don't fall into ruin after they are built, but buildings, buildings don't, don't fall rather fall into rise, rise after ruin they after they into built, they are buildings don't fall into after buildings don't rise, they are built into ruin. Rather, rise up before they into ruin. Before built are built, they are built. Buildings, buildings don't. Buildings don't fall. Don't fall into into ruin. After fall, ruin. After they are built, into they are but rather rise, ruin built, but into ruin before. After rather rise, they are built, they into ruin are before they built. Built, but rather rise into ruin before they are built. But rather rise into ruin before they are built. And the last, um, the last two, actually. Let's just do one of them, because they're pretty much the same. Uh, you get the idea from one of them. Um, these are radio alphabets. Um, so the first ever broadcast human speech was um, following a fascinating message by Reginald Fessenden, which went, one, two, three, four, is it snowing where you are, Mr. Thiessen? If it is, telegraph back and let me know. It was also the first weather report. Um, <laughs> And um, I took this, this message and I turned it into a radio alphabet where every letter is given as a word and that helps to combat the noise um, which accompanies radio broadcast. So it's a, it's a way of creating redundancy into the message. So Holly's going to help me with this one as well. This is Radio Alphabet 3, Intel, Saucepan, Intel. One, two, three, four. Intel, saucepan, Intel, tax dodge, saucepan, nor east, oil spill, 
wireless, Intel, Northeast, Gaussian, wireless, Hyderabad, estimate, real time, estimate, youngster, oil spill, undulate, Annabelle, real time, estimate, millivolt, real time, tax dodge, Hyderabad, Intel, estimate, source pan, source pan, estimate, northeast, Intel, Felix, Intel, tax dodge, Intel, source pan, tax dodge, estimate, lithium, estimate, ocean, real time, Annabelle, positive, Hyderabad, bank job, Annabelle, chicory, Korsakoff, Annabelle, Northeast, deep dish, lithium, estimate, tack dodge, millivolt, estimate, Korsakoff, Northeast, oil spill, wireless, end transmission. <laughs>